Hello and good morning. Hi guys, my name is Linda Jenkins and I'm your go-to person to help you with your parking issues when you're on the 18 wheelers. Now, today I'm going to be discussing with you the last in the three-part series that we've been having on doing our backs. Now, the first two videos that I did create, I was outside uh, of the truck in the distribution uh, parking lot going over with you the different angles uh, so that you could actually land into the spot and get actually bumped to the back. Now, I did get a message from Scotty and Scotty was asking me uh, during one of the videos, I said, please make sure to learn how to use your mirrors, but he didn't understand what I, I was referring to. So today we're going to go into that in more detail. If this is something that you think that you might be interested in, please remember to like and share this so that other people just like you can get that free help. Now these are free tips that I give on a weekly basis, so please feel free to share. Um, and then also remember to click on that uh, subscribe button with the little bell there as well. So for us to get started, I am going to go ahead and flip my phone. Now, as you can see, I am in a Target parking lot. Okay, this is at their warehouse distribution center. And I'm going to kind of scan a little bit slow so that I don't make you dizzy. You'll notice a gentleman walking across there. Okay, so this here, I'm going to pan down here, are both of our mirrors that we have in an 18-wheeler. Okay, now if I open my window because there's trucks running beside me, it's very loud. So I'm going to try to do this video through my window because it's imperative for you to see uh, the things that are important when you're trying to get docked. <clears throat> now, as stated before, you'll notice that yellow up and down line back there in the back near where that uh, red light is flashing back there. Now, that line, believe it or not, is actually about six inches thick, okay, or wide, okay? So, if I would have hit that yellow mark, directly on that mark I would have missed the door by about six inches right below there you'll notice that there's a little square that's the bumper pad as you'll recall that bumper pad is what I was actually aiming for and the uh, this one is actually a double one so um, that's to uh, accommodate the people with lift gates okay but ours is the single one so I knew to go to the inside now again if you'll notice as you look down the trailer you'll notice that there is that yellow line notice how nice and straight my truck is with that yellow line that's how you're wanting your truck to be when you get finished with your back, okay? It needs to be straight up and down. Now, to look at your mirrors, okay? I'm gonna kinda bring it back out a little bit. Okay, again, there's your mirror. We're gonna go all the way down, and you'll notice we have this second mirror. Now, that second mirror is called a concave mirror. Now, what its purpose is, is to give you a wide angle view. Notice how skinny this view is. It's very narrow and everything. You can't see what's going on beside you. Well, look here. This one here is fairly wide. It gives you a wide view angle. That's what I meant by, you know, uh, viewing the two mirrors and learning to use those correctly. So as you're backing, you need to lean up and lean back until you actually get that nice straight line. The reason is that, and for that is because the people on the fork trucks, when they're driving into the back of the trailer to load and unload it, they don't want to hit a big bump from the gap because that injures their back. So if you're going to be a, a nice driver, you always want to take care of that for your uh, loaders in the back or they might not load you correctly or they might miss some stuff and then all of a sudden you've got a bad load on the opposite end. So just be aware, be a nice, be courteous to, be courteous to your uh, lumpers and to your fork truck drivers who are actually doing the work to get you loaded so that you can get to your next destination both safe and accurate so guys if you like this type of video please remember to like and share subscribe below and then also if you have any questions always feel free to direct message me thank you guys y'all be safe out there and we'll see you next time bye